Hey guys, welcome in this tutorial, in which we're going to create uh, a Google Material design card. So I have my artboard here, set it up in Sketch, and the first thing that I'm going to do is going on the insert panel and uh, select a shape and uh, a rectangle. And um, I'm just going to create uh, a card shape over here. And uh, I'm also going to remove the borders and I'm going to center this and um, I'll do this with the align horizontal and also align uh, on the vertical axis so that uh, our card uh, is nice uh, and uh, centered. So after this, uh, I am going to change the fill color to white and um, let's add a little bit of shadow which is uh, really nice and uh, can really help uh, and get that uh, material design uh, effect. So I'm not going to use the one from the Google docu the documentations exactly, but uh, I mean, it's pretty, pretty similar. Um, I like to have like this nice and uh, smooth effect. And um, let's uh, also duplicate this rectangle and uh, I'm going to drag it up so that um, we're going to have the image right in this uh, second rectangle. So after that, I'm going on fill and um, I'll select this uh, image and uh, I'll choose uh, an image from uh, my uh, library. So I'm just gonna go like this and uh, let's use uh, this, uh, I think it's Mount Fuji, but don't quote me on that. <laughs> Um, so here we're having the image and now let's add a header and uh, a description. So this is the header of this card. And uh, since the theme uh, is uh, material design, we're going to use uh, Roboto, uh, which is a very widely used uh, um, typeface for uh, material design in, especially and uh, let's add a little bit of uh, a size over here and uh, let's duplicate this and um, here we're gonna have uh, our paragraph which uh, is going to be smaller and uh, I'm also going to adjust the size so okay and uh, since we need a, a little bit of text, uh, I'm just going to use uh, um, the Lipsum website, which uh, is one of the many ways in which you can get some uh, text, uh, even if you don't have uh, anything uh, at hand at the moment. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna grab some, uh, some of this text. Let's do something like this and uh, I'm gonna go back to sketch and uh, let's just paste it. So I'm going to adapt it uh, slightly um, so like this. I'll go one step less with the size and uh, I'm going also to adjust the line height so that uh, this card will have a little bit more of uh, a breathing room. Let's also kill the text at that space. And um, one thing that I like to do is make the body just a little bit lighter so that um, it's really easy to, to focus on, uh, on the header first and then uh, going on to uh, the paragraph. And uh, just gonna do like this. And um, yeah, we're pretty much uh, it. We, we can also add a, a hyperlink at the end. So maybe I read more text over, over here and uh, I'm gonna do this maybe in uh, this color and I'm gonna make it just a little bit bold, like not, not bold, but I'm gonna need to select the, the medium um, for this. And um, yeah, I mean, this is pretty much it. We can make the uh, background just a little bit uh, more gray so that the, the card will pop up even more and um, yeah you can simply go after this uh, group it duplicate it and uh, 
if you have your uh, material uh, cards. So if you enjoyed this video, uh, please subscribe to this channel uh, as I'm going to post uh, many more tutorials and uh, UI, UX design related videos. And um, yeah, if you have any questions, just drop a comment below and uh, I will get back to you. So thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next one.